How you doing guys? I'm Matt. Uh, how you doing? Uh, welcome to Can I Cook It? And we are already at the 10th episode. I just wanted to know, tell you that I'm, uh, I have another guest with me because it's always like kind of a tradition at this point. You want to come in? Sure. Hello, uh, this is uh, Judy Blake and tell us about yourself, Judy. So my name is Judy Blake and I am a program coordinator for Family to Family Network. I am also part of a wonderful program called Lone Star Lind and I am the proud mom of Jason and Ryan, who are 26 and 23. Nice, nice. Yeah! So, uh, what are we making anyway? We are making toffee squares, which is a layer of graham crackers. We're going to caramelize butter and brown sugar, pour it over the graham crackers. We're going to bake it. Mm -hmm. We're going to sprinkle chocolate chips on it. And then I'm going to show you the finished product because I already made another batch yesterday. Nice. She's already prepared for all of this. That's right. So, I got the apron on. What do you think? You look fabulous. That color works for you. All right. So now that we have, this is all the ingredients, right? It is. It all is. Right. And we have already washed our hands, which is really, really important. Yeah. So what we're going to do is, you just open your first package. So what we're going to do is, all right. you'll see. They've got little perforations. Yeah. So you have to be kind of gentle with them. And you're going to break there. All right. And you're going to break at that perforation. And you're just going to line them up on your pan like that. All right. So here's the next phase. And we are finished with putting all these crackers in here. So you can see there's not a lot of metal that you can see. There is a little bit there, but that's okay. Uh, maybe what we'll do is move this little piece here around. Mm. So what you want to do is, is you want to cover your pan yeah. as much as possible with graham crackers. Nice. Okay. And so we're going to uh, put the butter, right? Yep. We're uh, going to have butter and brown sugar. So what we're going to do is we're going to put in our right butter. Here. Yes, you sure are. Come on, butter though. Uh, but that's what makes it good. We love our butter. Really? So we're going to turn it on a little bit low right now. Yeah. So we already have the butter in the pan and now we're doing our light brown sugar. And what you always want to make sure with brown sugar is, is that they say make sure it's packed because brown sugar can be really dense. So you want to make sure that you pat it down mm. and that you have a full cup of brown sugar. All right. You're doing great. See, it's all kind of clumped together. Yeah. There you go. Perfect. So I'm now stirring it for um, uh, Judy. Uh, what else can you tell me about this so process? So what you want to do is you always have to keep stirring it. And the reason you have to keep doing that is because otherwise you don't want it to burn on the bottom. Okay. And also um, you don't want it to start sticking together too much. So you just have to keep stirring it and stirring it because eventually what's going to happen is, is the butter is going to blend in with the brown sugar and it's going to turn into like caramel or in our case toffee. So you see how it's still bubbling? Yeah. That's sure. okay. See, it's still bubbling, but that's okay. And you're just going to pour it on. Wow, it smells strong. It does, but that's okay. Don't forget too, you have a gas stove, so it's a little bit different. Oh yeah, true. So what we're going to do is... You take your spoon and you're just going to gently spread the graham crackers. Do you want to do that? Yeah, yeah, of course. So you just want to take the toffee and just gently spread it so that all of the toffee is spread over all of the graham crackers. All right. So now that we spread the, uh, the caramel? Mm -hmm. Or the toffee, whichever right. you want to call it. Over. What do we do next? What we're going to do is we're going to pop it in the oven. Right. Our oven was preheated to 350. So what we're going to do is we are going to place it in the oven and you see that you can put it on different racks. We're going to put it on the top rack mm -hmm. and we are going to set the timer for, here's the timer, here it is, for only eight minutes. Mm -hmm. So in eight minutes, what's going to happen is it's going to come out. It's going to be all bubbly. Mm -hmm. And what's great is we're going to take our mini chocolate chips. We're going to sprinkle them evenly over the um, hot toffee squares. Can I see that finished product? You bet you can. And here you go. Nice. Yes. Take a look. We have our toffee squares and they have mini chocolate chips sprinkled all over them. And they're really, really soft to begin with. Mm. So what happens is, is you have to separate them. They'll harden up. And why don't you try one? All right. I mean, we, we are still baking it like in the mm -hmm. oven, but we just want to uh, keep this uh, short at least, you know, so. 
But I'm gonna try this anyway, so let me see what how it tastes like. Wow. Is that a good wow or a mm, wow? It could be more like a uh, creamy kind of wow. You know what I mean? Is it supposed to be creamy? Well, they're sugary. Oh, sugary. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Chocolate. I think because of these mini chocolate chips. It could be. That could be. So, did you cook it? Well, technically. I mean, it's still in the oven, but yeah. yeah. Yes, you did. Yeah. Go, Matthew. Thank you. So, uh, thank you for watching. Um, like, subscribe, share this video if you want. Uh, thank you for joining this 10th episode. This is completely the 10th episode, right? I can't believe it. The 10th episode. Yeah. That is amazing. Well, stay tuned for future episodes and uh, hope you have a good time. Uh, have a good one. Bye-bye.